Baby, I'm a gangster too, and it takes me to tango. You don't wanna mess with me, mess with me. Baby, I'm a gangster too. What is up, guys? Shinobi Evie here back again with another episode of Sword Line and Alice's, not Alice's Station, Hollow Realization here. This is episode number seven, y'all. And we looks like we are Sinon and Asuna already here. So let's go ahead and see what we got going here. Alright. これをもらうクエストはもう起動しなくなったんだってね。そんなに目を輝かせないでよ。言いたいことはわかるけど。なら、みんなで手分けしてプレミアちゃんに関係しそうな情報を集めて、もし怪しいところを見つけたら連れて行ってみるの。こいつはね、あなたのことが気になってしょうがない。私が気になる。で、I ナンパかしら。ナンパね。で、どうしたの喉が渇いていなかったので。喉が渇いてなかったって。ふめ、ポイントスイーンのおつゴアン。そうなんですか。そうそう。焼き餅を焼く人がいるからね。はい、はい。
and she uses a rapier, it looks like. see what's going on here it's like fencing all over again this reminds me of when Kirito was teaching Yu-Gi-Oh how to use the Aincrad style bro why does our character actually kind of look like one of those teachers from an anime though Like I, I, I'm like the sensei right now. Finally, I have my apprentice. I even got the cool katana to go with it and everything, bro. It's like Vulpal Strike. Oh, there it is. Not bad. <laughs> it took stabbing me. Alright, well it looks like we're going to be finding some monsters, I hope, or I think it might just end up being a cutscene. This game is really, like, what is it, story-oriented, but hey, look at that, we're actually going to let her... We're actually going to let her fight. Alright, let's do it. These guys are going to be a piece of the cake, though, it's just going to be, boom, like a boss. Like a boss, the sensei being OP, bro, one hit. I'm so used to the 3D animated characters that like the 2D f still frames, they kind of bug me a little bit, but it is what it is. I still kind of enjoy it. Oh boy, here we go. We're about to teach him the Aincrad style, <laughs> but Katana version. Or Iron Ground, technically, not Aincrad. <laughs> I feel like if they were able to let Yui fight, she'd be busted as hell, bro. Like, not even gonna lie, she would be, she'd be crazy. Time to see what we got next. One thing I'm glad that I don't have to do is whenever I'm leveling up, I don't have to really worry about leveling up everybody too much.
All right, so it looks like we got some questing to do. Damn it, Premier's. <laughs> Damn it, we don't have Straya with us, but hey, honestly, I wanted to quest around with some new people anyways, so. Uh, we got Silica, actually, at level 20. If we can find her, I have a dagger we can give her, because I think hers... Damn, I don't think I could see it. Let me freeze the friends. Let's see, Silica's? Uh, she's only at plus three, so I can't get her weapon. I've been doing some research on this game, and in order to give, um, any of these characters a weapon, you have to have them with the intimacy at rank four, and in order for you to get their to give them armor or anything like that, they have to be at rank 5. So right now, I could get Austin a weapon, or I could give, you know, uh, Yui a weapon, or Straya. Hell, I could trick with Straya. If I get a two-handed sword and some clothes for her, I can give her that. Yuki's already 5, so I could give her some armor too. You know, I'm gonna start working on a bunch of characters. I might start working on Klein too, because if I get some other Katanas, we might have a Katana squad out here, so. Yeah, I know. So far, so good, though. I'm definitely gonna keep straight out of my party. Yuki, I might take out, but for the time being, honestly, I might honestly put Onsen in there, too, because I have a rapier I can give her. So, who knows, but for the time being, I think that's where we're gonna leave our team. We're just gonna leave it the way it is. But if we do see any of these characters wandering around, we're definitely gonna try and keep them with us. Let's go check the quest board and see what we got to do. Oh, uh, we got Argo here. We got Argo up in here. Let's see what we got. だから、ここは情報屋にとって格好の営業所なんだよ。そんな迷えるプレイヤーにお姉さんがとっておきの情報を教えてあげるぞ。別にお題はいらないよ。I mean, we rich anyway, bro. We got money. から、俺たちが教えるのは新しいネームドモンスターが見つかったっていう情報だけだ。そんなこと売り歩くまでもなくすぐにむしろそのモンスターの情報が欲しいから挑戦するプレイヤーを増やしたいわけさじゃあメッセージに情報を送って黒の剣士だからなんだか知らねえけど調子に乗ってんだよブ
超攻撃型スタイルどんな感覚を持っているのか相手の攻撃に対しても先が戦っている時の異様に高いテンションも相まってアンチとファンが急激に増えてひっひょっとしたらお前も獲物を横取りされるかもしれないもっと詳しいことを知りたいなら言ってくれいつああ。He said exposition. That's, that's how people feel whenever they play these kind of games, have so much exposition. ここで何してるんだ花…はあ、最終クエストってわけだなちょうどさっきまでオレっちも集めていたんだよニュッフ情報屋は誰よりも早くクエストをクリアしないと商売にならないからなそれなら100コルで売るぞ Yeah, 100 coals and nothing, bro. We rich. We got that money when you're right now. Probably does give a luck bonus, that's what it sounds like. So, you know, Kono Quest no Irino Shiga, Koi Bito do Mezrashi Hana o Shuni Sono Moide Banashiga, Koriakuni Kanke Stairkamo Shirenai Hareda Kenagai Hanashio Kikasaretanda, Nanika Tatoeba, Skore no Hanaja Nakte, Ko Choto Kensho Stemilka. All right, let's see it. ありがとう。これで花飾り。それは良かったな。感謝の印に、うちに代々伝わる鎧をもらってくれないか。ありがたく受け取らせてもらう。たまたまだよ。それより検証を手伝ってくれたのに、本当に何もいらないの。All right, so we got a little bit of a quest done right there. Little cutscene done with Argo. Did some questing with Argo. Let's see. Let's see if we got anything else that we can do here. It's definitely accept all of these because we, we we've been doing a lot of stuff so. Even though we don't get you know, a lot of experience or any experience for some of these, they do give you a lot of money. And money, <laughs> you can never have too much money in this game, especially when you're starting out like I am. So, in fact, actually, if we're being real here, look at all the freaking quests we are already done. And then the rest of these, yeah, look at us. All this experience we're getting, plus all the money we're getting, bro. We're gonna be rich, rich by the time we're done with all these quests, man. Like, look at all of this. We had like 20 or so quests that we did right there. Wait, how 
how much money we got. Look at our money, bro. Look at our money, bro. We are rich out here, bro. We are filthy rich. But <laughs> let's go over here. Um, honestly, let's bring Straya back with us, honestly. Just for the hell of it. Because I want to get her intimacy to plus five. That's what I want to work on at the moment. Damn right. So I want to get her intimacy to plus five before we do anything. But I want to also check out what armor we got over here. I want to check out armor or anything new that we got from the quest that we did. So we did get some Lithium Earrings, which will increase our defense. Uh, let's see. What else will we get? So we got Cliff Leggings, which will increase our defense, but it lowers our speed. We do not want to work with that. However, let's see what this guy got for Katanas. Okay, so he has nothing for katanas, unfortunately. Unfortunate. All this money, but we can't spend it. Anyway, let's go ahead and check out a new area and see what we got to work with here. Let's check out what we got to work with here. So far, though, I'm enjoying the game. We've gotten some progress done, so. That last section, though, that we went with the forest area, that that area was huge, man. So much freaking, there's so much exposition we had to do in that area. Also a good farming section, though. But we got to level 21 from that, so that wasn't too bad. Oh, we got an announcement. It's settled no sleep tonight. How I feel grinding sword online Alice Edition Licorice for a jewel sword. Galactic jewel. If any of y'all play Alice Edition Licorice, you know what I'm talking about. I wonder what level you have to be in order to do it. That is the real question. Okay, yeah, we definitely ain't gonna be able to do it. <laughs> 50 or above? Hell no. Nah. See what we got here though. It looks like we got a romance option with Stray real quick, so let's knock that out. I at least try to do one of these every single time. In fact, actually I want to try something. Because I think you can I think if you do this first. I think if you do this first. And then I forgot how you were supposed to do it. Shoot. I forgot how you're supposed to do it, but there's there's like a trick to doing it to where you could actually get all the intimacy to go up faster. I just forgot how to do it. I was working at it on YouTube, but I'll I'll have to test that out later, I guess. 
I guess I'll have to test that out later, but let's go ahead and check out where we gotta go first. Okay, so we gotta go all the way over here. We gotta go all the way over here. Let's do it then. Let's do it then, boys. Let's get it. Alrighty. Curious to see what this new area is all about that we're going to be going with. Got them hops, boy. We out here jumping over stuff. And there's a green tortoise. Let's take him out. Boom. Let's go. These tortoises give you a lot of experience, too. So before we kill these things, I'm going to start popping the XP. You know, the raging bulls. Damn, we killed him with the raging bulls. Alright, let's keep it going here. Let's keep it going. Another green tortoise is going down. Not too shabby. Let's go around and see what other enemies we got. Looks like we got some crabs over here. Which means you already know what time it is. It's time to hit him with this Tsukushima. And then after that, let's hit him with this switch move right here. Nice, nice. Keep it going. I love the katana, bro. I just love it. I'm probably never gonna switch off of this unless I really have to. Like this thing is just so fun to use. Look at that. Three in a row, just like that. Just like that. It's crazy. Look at that. We're almost level 21 just based off of those kills that we're getting right there. Look at that. Look how much experience we get just by taking these things out. It's crazy. And we're doing so much damage. This is the perfect squad right here. We got a tank. We got a healer. Two DPS. It's crazy. Boom. Boom. Just like that. Not too bad. Let's check these guys out over here, man. It's just it's just like clockwork out here, man. It's like clockwork. It's like clockwork out here, boys. Man, anyway, let's keep it moving. Boy got the hops. Look at that, bro. I wish I could hop like that in real life. I wish I could do it. Take down another one of these. I thought I did the finisher. <laughs> I thought I did the finisher. <laughs> Guess not. <laughs> Love that AoE. Looks like we got a tree enemy over here. You can't sneak around me. I got AoE damage, man. What do you think this is? What do you think this is, boys? Alright, let's see. What else we got over here? Got some ground wood. We got to make a fire out here. Boom. Perfect, bro. That was flawless. That was flawless. Nice. Looking nice out here. So we're gonna have to hop our way up here this time. Look at this. We out. 
We got them legs, bro. It's leg day. You never skip leg day out here. Ooh, looks like we got a new area with some new beasts. So you already know what time it is. Got him. Let's try out to see what these guys can do. Ooh, level 15. We should get some decent experience. They still get shredded, though. Oh my gosh. Look at that, bro. They just get shredded one after another. We'll probably level up to 21 right now pretty soon if we keep this up. I'll tell you that much. Alright. Let's see what we got over here. This is a pretty long episode, I'm not gonna lie to you. We did a quest with Argo and everything. I'm gonna try and figure out how many how much I can fit into this, but. I wanted to at least get some action for you guys, because I didn't want the whole quest, the whole episode to be basically us talking with Argo. I want to get some, some action in here. Some action in this episode here. It's hard to lock on to these things. There we go. Oh, there we go. I have to make sure I lock on. That's why I be missing sometimes. Because I'm not locking onto these things. I'm just swinging my sword at this point. It's so efficient having that AoE though. Like, it just makes it so easy to clear mobs like that. Especially when they're all packed up together like that. It's just easy money. It's just boom. Keep it moving. This is how the game is supposed to be right here. This is why I like over leveling. Because it makes the game smooth and like it's actually kind of fun. It doesn't make you tired just trying to play through it. What I mean by tired, I mean like... You know, there's those times where you be trying to fight a boss and you lose so many times because you're under level and you're not prepared. So then it makes you get like really tired. <laughs> it's that kind of thing. And you know, as you can see, we're not having to really deal with that considering the fact that we're just shredding these bosses really one after another. We got level 21 here. Switch them out. There you go, flawless boys. Good work. Looks like we got a boss over here. Looks like we got a boss over here. And you already know what time it is that we got a boss. Except this man with all that. Let's get him, level 25. Looks like the scrubs need some help, so let's help him out. Oh yeah, this is gonna be one of these bosses. So let's switch him out. And then we're gonna hit him with this. Actually, he has a guard up, right? I got something perfect for that. There we go. There we go. Let's hit him with another one. Yeah. He don't like that. Hold up. Oh, this guy's tanky, though. Damn. This guy's tanky. Trying to break through his staying shield, but he won't let me, bro. This man, he tanky, man. He don't want, he don't want to go down. We are pushing him back though, so I am glad to see that. Some a bunch of skills. Skill chain, skill chain, skill chain, skill chain. Skill chain. This. Oh, now this guy is gonna give us a lot of XP based off what I'm seeing right now. I mean a lot. Him with this. This guy can't even move though. We're hitting him with all these attacks. We're giving this man the business. We got, we got another guard break right here. There we go. We're keeping his HP up there too. That's another thing. Oh shit. Everybody hit him. There we go. Back him up. Back him up. Look at this. He can't even move. Boom. Let's move out of the way a little bit so he doesn't do the thing he did before. And with this Senka right here. Boom. Look at that damage, bro. Senka does so much, bro. It's crazy. Dude, Senka does, does so much. Like, watch this when we use it. Especially when he's defending. Like, look at that damage, bro. That is crazy. Let's 
insane damage right here. Like, we're just backing him up. Like, look at that. Look at that level up. We got so much experience. I'm definitely going to be farming this area. Definitely going to be farming this area. Because this area... This area got the goods, bro. Not too shabby. Alright, let's keep it going, though. That wasn't too bad of a boss fight right there. Not gonna lie to you. That was pretty interesting. Got to test out Senko's damage, too. So that was, that was pretty sick. Let's move it back to Tsukushima. Check out a couple more of these beasts here. Not too shabby. This is like 35 minutes. I didn't remember. Like, time goes by so fast like this. I think we found the area we need to get to, though. Because here's the gate. Here is the gate. Let's see what's up what's up with here? Flintum Trail in the main game. Okay, so we can't even access this area right now at the moment. So where do we gotta go? Wait, like, hold on, let me go to the map. Cause I need to figure out where I'm at. Poison Swamp. Oh, you know what? I'm an idiot. I'm such an idiot. See, this is why I'm glad I saved this area. Because I remember I went here on accident in the last episode. And I didn't go and do much in this area. But this is where we need to go. We need to go into this forest. And that will lead us here. So I didn't even need to go all the way up here. It was still worth exploring all this though. So I will, I will grant it that much. But I think that's where we're going to end it for now. We did a lot of questing with Argo from the looks of it. But we also got a lot of questing done in this area. So in the next episode, we're going to be definitely checking out the next area right there. And we're going to be getting some more story done. But without further ado, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. It wasn't a lot of story that we got done. But either way, we got some interesting stuff. So without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next episode. I'm out. Stay cool, y'all.